So in this video, we're going to go through another example. We've got the matrix M is 2, 4, 3, 13. Okay? So, same idea then. So, we're going to do M take away lambda I. Okay? So, M take away lambda I is going to be equal to 2 take away lambda, 4 take away 0, 3 take away 0, 13 take away lambda. Okay? So that's going to be my matrix. The determinant of this will be equal to 0. So 2 take away lambda, 4, 3, 13 take away lambda equals 0. So we're going to get 2 take away lambda times 13 take away lambda. Take away 4 times 3, so take away 12 equals 0. So multiplying this out, we've got 26 uh, take away 2 lambda, take away 13 lambda, uh, plus lambda squared, take away 12 is 0. So lambda squared, uh, we've got take away 15 lambda, then we've got 26, take away 12, so plus 14 equals 0. So that factorises to lambda take away 14, lambda take away 1 equals 0. So uh, lambda 1 is going to be equal to 1, and lambda 2 is going to be equal to 14. OK, so we've got our two eigenvalues. Right, now we need to find the corresponding eigenvectors. So for lambda 1 equals 1, OK? So we want to substitute the lambda 1 into this, so 1 goes in here. So we are going to have 2 take away 1, so 1, 4, 3, and then 13 take away 1, so 12. And that's going to multiply with your first eigenvector, and that's going to get you 0. OK, so we've got 1, 4, 3, 12 times x, y uh, is going to be equal to the 0 vector. So we've got x plus 4y equals 0, and 3x plus 12y is equal to 0. OK? So, from that, you could see that this equation is uh, 3 times that one. OK? So, what you're getting here um, is y is equal to minus a quarter x, and the same for this one. Okay, so um, what could you have as your eigenvector? So we want to use uh, nice values here, okay? Um, so if we used uh, x to be 4, then your y value would be minus 1. Okay, so your corresponding eigenvector for... Um, Lambda 1 equals 1 would be that. OK, so let's have a look at the second eigenvalue. So lambda 2 is 14. So lambda 2 is 14. So once again, pop that in there. So 2 take away 14 uh, gets us minus 12. Then we can have 4, 3. Then 13 take away 14 is minus 1. And... So I'll write the whole thing out, so that's times v2 is equal to 0. So minus 12, 4, 3, minus 1 times xy will be equal to the 0 vector. So we have minus 12x plus 4y equals 0, and 3x take away y is equal to 0. So this one's getting you y is equal to 3x, clearly. And... Uh, so is this one multiplying through by minus 4, right? So that's also y equals 3x. So then v2, OK, pop in a nice value of x. So x is 1. The y value is going to be 3. And so you've got the corresponding eigenvector to go with the eigenvalue. Okay, and so that is how we can find the eigenvalues and eigenvectors for this example.